Uh-oh. All right. Yeah. I get to hear a fight go down here in a second. Maybe there'll be a fight. We'll we'll flip the camera around if there is. <laughs> but whatever happens, it's not going to be as good as a movie we just. Oh, not as good as fights in New York Ninja. Well, I don't know about the fights, but the movie overall. Somebody's going to defend them real quick. You found some special for us today. Oh, it's a gym. It's a, probably more of a piece of art, piece of history than it would have been if it came out in its original entirety. Probably. Yeah. Um, it was, I believe, written and directed by, was it John Liu? John Liu originally was the, he was the writer, director, and main, our main dude, our main protagonist. Oh, yeah. This one, and I think I have some other movies that he was in. Really? And just not have noticed it, but there, there's like a lot of backstory to this. It was... He was wanting to make a movie in America and then something about losing the budget for it. Right. And so they didn't get to finish filming this. They didn't get to do the audio for this. So right. Vinegar Syndrome came in. They bought the rights to this, pieced it together themselves, finished the story, and then hired their own band and other actors and actresses to come in to do the audio. So all the voiceover work is new? Yeah. We got Don the Dragon Wilson playing John Liu. We got Linnea Quigley. Linnea Quigley as Randy. Randy the the chick, the uh, chick reporter, <laughs> reporter lady. That weird. Yeah. Because <laughs> uh, I remember seeing her name on the back of the box. I'm like, oh, Linnea Quigley's in this. And then that, I'm, that was we I get through too, and I'm and like, where's Linnea yeah. Quigley? Where yeah. is she? <laughs> no, just her voice. Yeah. Which probably in 2021 that's better. About all you want. Yeah, that's the voice. You don't know from Linnea Quigley. Yeah. <laughs> But well, what's the movie? We did. The, I don't think we said. Oh, uh, uh, New York Ninja. Oh. New York Ninja. Uh-oh. Oh, there, there we is going to be a fight. Not the fight. Stop bucking in my face. Bucking in my face. Stepping in my face. Stepping in my face. Stepping in my face. Stepping in my face. He was sitting there, but he was talking about shit. Here. Yeah. 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 If they can't hear this on the on our video, yeah. you should maybe up the audio. If not, we'll just have to edit it out. Yeah. Jordan, Jordan, you need to stop yelling at me. No, I'm not talking to you. But you are fucking yelling at me. He's space trying to get in my face. And you were yelling at her. You need to stop. No, them. that motherfuckers came at me and said they was going to punch me in my shit. Stop. Woman, man, man. And they get shit on their hands. Well, then maybe you should go. Stop. Stop. Because you don't want me to and you're not fucking listening. You need to stop. 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 Why are they getting all... I don't know, what about the other fucking... Yeah, the other dude's saying shit. So I say, you gotta kick everyone. Yeah, that dude's saying stuff down now. He was just sitting there. Alright. Fucking the, the girl dressed in a green chain for you. Amazing. You ever do these shots? Yeah, right? no, let's do these shots. You thought you were coming here for a movie. Cheers. Yeah. 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 Yeah, 
I'm just thinking, yeah, I think he might be, he might be in the right. I don't know. I'm just saying, 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 I'm just saying
oh, I'm also pregnant. It, it is just, it's such an awkward conversation. It is awkward yeah. in how he holds her. It looks like he's getting ready yeah. to throw her. They're both standing our distance, grabbing yeah. each other's and shoulders. He's like, you can, he's, <laughs> you can tell he, he's She's not made like, very much contact with women. I, I love you. And he's like... <laughs> I love, I love you, you too. too. Yes. I'm so happy right now. <laughs> I'm gonna be a daddy. Yeah. <laughs> but before they can have her little birthday party, she gets caught up in a, an abduction and sees it happening. And the gang, the gang bangers, uh, cut her throat. Yes, yeah, kill her. Dump her down the stairs. And the guy takes the knife, throws the it. The most amazing falling down the, the stairs. She spins downstairs, yeah. standing up. Oh, oh. <laughs> And then slowly slides down. <laughs> and, then the, and then the after he's like, mm, nah, throw this, throw this knife at her stomach. Yeah, I already cut her throat, yeah. but that's not enough. That's not enough. And take that unborn child, too. Yeah. So then we've got... Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so then we've got our uh, New York Ninja. He's, he's all fucking sad and shit. He cries for a little while, breaks the table at his birthday party. But then he pulls out his sword oh. and starts training. Yeah, starts training, cuts his hands up with glass. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then, he cuts his own fingers with his sword. Yeah, and he brought up the good point. Yeah, you never do that. You'll never have those fingers. <laughs> yeah. But he does. He's got his fingers. Um, and uh, it's a it's a revenge vigilante, you know. Yeah. He he, he dresses up like a, a white ninja. A white ninja. Occasionally he has on roller skates. So that's so this is the thing. Like we got what's the first crime he stops? I can't remember. Uh, well, he sees the kid gets bullied up. Let's that go. Right. Because the kid owes money to this game. Let's him go. And it's another gang, but it's a couple walking out of like a gift shop or grocery store in New York. And that was his first crime that he stopped from that game. Nothing crazy happened in there, but it was just him kicking a bunch. Yeah, he he kind of just stands in one spot, and yeah. then all the all the enemies surround him, and he just kicks. Yeah, all around him. It's not. I mean, oh no, it was. The one against him. He had his uh, wife ashes in the thing. Oh, and they're right. like, oh, give me that. Let me hold on to so it. So he has that yeah. fight just as himself. Yeah. And then he Becomes he just shows up ninja. later as yeah. the ninja. Right. <laughs> and, uh, but yes, you point out the roller skate thing. And that's this is one of the best <laughs> scenes. So random. Randomly. And the, there's like, there's got to be guerrilla filming on this because there's so many shots and just these huge crowds in oh, New York yeah. City. There's no way they pay shot, for that. Like on the subway and stuff. And the coming off this party. Too. Yeah, there's this huge street party. And but there is one scene where he randomly has fucking roller skates on. <laughs> no reason. Just, I got him. It is like a chase scene. <laughs> and he's like spinning and he'll like hit hit these dudes because you know he's chasing he's, he's chasing them and then they're chasing him. And then there's a scene where he's running and he suddenly he doesn't have the skates he does a flip he runs and then he flips and then he has the skates on again <laughs> i gotta wonder if that was if if vinegar syndrome cut that together that way or if it was intended you know what i mean yeah, yeah. it was intended to be part of the same chase because it's so funny you just see that just that jump of the skates and then later on, I was so I wanted to see the skates on later in the movie, and I was so bummed because he gets there's this like car chase. He's chasing this car, and he, that he hooks perfect. it. He hooks it with a grappling hook. And like, oh god, get the skates, get the skates. Yeah. But he does. He just gets dragged by the and then, and then kicks the hatch, the trunk open, and flips on into it. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty funny too. And the villain in this one, the main villain. Yes. Still don't know how he gets he gets off from Pluto. Well, they Italian. they do they do say he was like in the CIA and they there were experiments done on him with radiation. Okay. They do say that at one point they just 
somebody randomly says, oh, yeah, it's this guy, and then he's got all this. <laughs> yeah, and they just explain it because yeah. we see this guy, okay, like he has – he has shades on, and he's got these things on the side blocking out the light. Yeah. He's really fucking weird. He, he just, like, he talks like... Yeah, he does weird things with his he did, And he's got this, like, he's got this pen that's a dart, that shoots darts. That poison. Cool and he just, he yeah. can just hit anything. Like, he hits a fly with it. Yeah. So, but this is a guy that's getting... That's getting paid to catch these women with, or like this international prostitution yeah. ring. Or this, it's, yeah, it's like he's like Epstein. He's like the Jeffrey Epstein of our story, <laughs> um, except he doesn't take him to a private island. Ask gets, him to give him a massage. He dies, but he doesn't yeah. kill himself. Yeah, that's what I'm um, <laughs> he, uh, this guy. We see this guy later on. And it's out of nowhere, and we're just like, what is happening? Just take it back. What the fuck's going on? We see him. He's sitting in the dark, and he opens this fucking container. So it's like this a green with glow. Gear. Yeah. There's this green glow coming out, and his fucking hands are rotting off. His face is melting, and he's. It's like he's getting his. He's, he's getting the best boy yeah. job. Yeah. It's it's the most amazing thing. And and he's just his fucking the skin's coming off his hands. <laughs> And then he takes a fucking candle and puts his hand on the candle. Yeah. And he's like, <laughs> and that's, I guess, how you know he's done. It's how he gets off. Yeah. That's really weird. It's yeah. so good. I wonder, like, are you feeling the pain from the candle to the burn after dealing with plutonium? I feel like plutonium burns way harsher than you'd be numb to the candle, I would assume. Well, I don't know if you'd burn at all from plutonium. You would just get sick and die pretty quickly. <laughs> I don't know. But but he just, he's getting off of it. It's yeah. really weird. I did like the second time of him getting off with the girl he hypnotized. Where this is this is great. So yeah, <laughs> so yeah. There's the the Halloween party in the street, and he hypnotizes this girl to come with him. And so, yeah, it just cuts to her fucking huge dangling tits in the like cloak tight in, and then it kind of zooms out. It comes out yeah. her face. You see his face. Yeah. Like, what the fuck's happening? It seemed to me what I thought was happening was she was hanging from something. Yeah. Like she was hanging from her hands and feet. Yeah. And she was being tortured. I thought. That's what I thought. It was just oddly positioned camera angle that she was facing him. He was facing her. They were just hard. In the in the yeah. Line. She was just like. But they were in a like limousine. Yeah, line. but she was it was cowgirl or reverse. It cowgirl. was reverse. Yeah. And it's yeah. so it's so that he, he fucking he's like yeah. and he like chokes her to she kills her chokes her while he's like, chokes her out and then burns her back with, with his. his plutonium burning hands. Yeah, he's got radiation <laughs> hand powers or some shit. It's so weird. <laughs> well, this man gets the girls. Yeah. We got uh, ninja kids. Oh, yeah, ninja kids. There's all these ninja kids at one point. Kid took a bullet for the ninja. Because New York ninja becomes... He, every, he becomes like... You know, he's like Superman or Batman. Or yeah, it's typical. We got a vigilante. They're showing like... They're showing newspaper... Headlines: of, oh, New York Ninja is saving the city and all this shit. And so all these kids start imitating him. But there's a scene where he's fighting, and I forget what happens. But oh, he gets arrested. Oh, yeah, that's towards one the end. Scene. Yeah, he gets arrested. But there's another one where they fight the bad guys. Oh, it was they were in. They were grabbing somebody else. They were in another park. They were trying to kidnap the uh, the, the female reporter, Randy. And they were doing an interview with the mayor. Yeah. That they picked up off the street. Hey, you want to say some things? Fifty bucks. Yeah. yeah <laughs> and and the gang comes up, knocks the mayor out, grabs right. a girl, and then all the kids. The kids come show up. Uh, <laughs> most of them are dressed like ninjas. Some of them have just like I love yeah. New York ninja yeah. shirts on. And you got a young Jason. Is it Briggs or Briggs? Jason. There's a kid that looks just like Jason Briggs. It probably was. Him. <laughs> 
because I feel like he's what forty something. I mean, well, let's see. American Pie came out in what ninety? Is it ninety something? Like late nineties, early two thousands. Yeah. Nah, that kid seemed a bit old. He would have. Because if it was yeah. done in eighty four, probably yeah. It yeah this probably, might be his older brother. Yeah, it could be. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's just a stupid scene with all these ninja kids beating up the yeah the gangs. Yeah, the, yeah we got them. These fucking YMCA. <laughs> yeah, def- the definitely. gangs in this yeah. in this movie are fucking hilarious. They're amazing. They just flip over cars. They dress weird. Uh, you gotta watch it. I've never seen. Okay, I, I was about to say I've never seen a less threatening gang, but then I was thinking about uh, Alley Cat with the grocery no. stealing gang. Yeah. Other than Alley Cat, yeah, than this is like the lamest gang you've ever seen. It is. Like, why are you depending on these people to smuggle women? It's crazy. But they just roam. They're just roaming the streets every, in open, attacking people in the open. Everybody's just watching and like... Uh, It is what it is. Old New York. That's what happens. Crime. Crime runs rampant. Got porn theaters. Gotta keep your head down. Yeah. Yes. Keep your head down. I hope they don't look at you next. Yeah. You don't want to get robbed. (laughs) (laughs) I don't. Is there anything else you want to. I don't want. We don't need to. I don't. Yeah. We don't need to get away everything because you don't eat. The story everything. is very simple. It's it is just a back and forth. Simple story. We don't want to give away everything because it was very enjoyable being taken by surprise on all this. You want to enjoy the ride. Right. Yeah. I do like the one bad guy that's got the rat tail. Oh. And he, he fucking he pulls it across and clenches it in his teeth. Oh, that man. And he's amazing. And he, they have a, a dual sword fight at the end, but then he starts doing drunken boxing yeah. against our ninja. Wish we had more of that man, though. Yeah, he just sort of slices him and he dies. Yeah. They had to work with what they could work with. John Luke. John Luke. Is that his name? Yeah. 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 Come back. <laughs> he come back, yeah. <laughs> I don't know how you are now, but write something else for us. Yeah, it's <laughs> it's just it hits the funny bad perfectly. Mm-hmm. The action is cheesy in all the right ways. Oh yes. Um, the just the mannerisms, like the, the ninja. There's that scene where he they're in the park and he's inside a fucking tree. He's just like, and he's just like he's like this, like he does these weird poses, right? And then he throws out a grappling hook, yes. and he hooks the guy, and he like pulls him up. You know, it, it, it's just <laughs> there's so many things that got his shurikens embroidered with New York ninja. Yeah, he's got his branded branded shurikens. It's just so funny. Everything is just funny. I I've la- I laugh more at this movie than anything I've seen in a while. I think. Um, yeah, New York Ninja. Yeah. Can we get reviews? Oh, yeah. To it? Five, five, five. Five, it's five, it's five. Fucking go buy There's this. There's no doubt. It. There's a five. I'm buying this tonight. <laughs> I'm gonna buy it because at some point I'm gonna want to watch this again or show it to somebody. Oh yeah. Which is why. You gotta watch this. Thing. The last one I, the only other one I bought that I had already seen was Alley Cat. I did buy that. Just oh, you did? It. Yeah, I did. Just see those titties again. <laughs> what was her name again? Ireland. Kelly Ireland. The chick. I don't know. That was her only movie. I don't remember. It was Kelly Ireland because I remember it was like a country. No, Kathy Ireland was from. Uh, Kathy. Kathy Ireland was the famous model. I think you're getting your. Oh, your that movies. was Alley Cat. Kathy Ireland. No, Kathy Ireland was from L.A. Uh, uh, oh yeah, Lost in L.A. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, my <laughs> yeah, bad. Yeah, my no. bad. No, she's very famous. Yes, yes. The one from <laughs> Alley Cat, it was. She literally only did. Yeah, that was it. She did yeah. two movies, maybe, and then yeah. just probably started a family and had twelve kids or whatever. Yeah, I made enough off these movies. I mean, 
on my side movies. I mean, it's not their name. I mean, those titties were made to be milked. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, yeah, uh, yeah. The, this is a, and what I was I was thinking when we started watching this, I'm like, this is like the old days of the channel when we first started discovering this shit. Oh yeah, I had that feeling again. Yeah. you know, and it did make me wish Brian was here to watch it with us. Yeah, but right old, old Brian. You know, uh, I'll have to text him later. And yeah. Be like, hey, dude, you, you didn't get this one. You need to. Yeah, uh, New York Ninja. Yeah, New York Ninja. Uh, great movie. And it's amazing that they were able to pull it off. Oh, yeah. And, and bring it together into something. Uh, really great job to Vinegar Syndrome. And I can't say that a lot about Vinegar Syndrome. I feel like. Here lately, yes. But yeah, good with that. I, I feel like a lot of their releases are. They seem nice and the packaging is good, but then you watch the movie, you're like, yeah, yeah, paid fifty dollars for this. But this one fucking hits on the level, almost on the level of Samurai Cop, almost. Oh yeah. Uh, yeah. So I can't, I can't say it's as good as Samurai Cop, but it's you get that feeling. Yes, yeah, yeah. definitely in my top ten of bad. Yeah, bad I think it might be. It might be. It, it, it's. It's fucking insane in all the right ways. But it might have an asterisk though. Vinegar Syndrome came in and stepped it up. They did, yeah. but that's the thing though. That they did it right. Yeah. They were able to actually yeah. do that. That's impressive. Yeah. Really impressive. It is. So there you go. They get a gold star. New York Ninja. You get special. You get two five out of fives, and then also a gold star. A gold star. It's our new. <laughs> You get that coveted gold star. If you get, yeah, if both of us give it a five out of five, maybe we'll also give it the gold star. The gold star is for two. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Oh, where are them wings? Uh, I hope they're coming. 